TV4 video of my art studio. It's a gigantic mess, but it's going to be a lot better. I'm excited. Hey everyone, welcome to Art Studio Makeover. I'm so excited to get a working space. Um, repainted the walls white, and now I'm going to be painting around this mural, and then I'll show you the trim color. So excited! So I am redoing the floors in my art studio. They're really old, pretty beat up. Um, actually, so the whole, like there's three rooms downstairs in our house that have these floors and we were told that they cannot be refinished um, because they're too thin, at least not professionally. So what I did is I just took this little hand sander. I just took off, where is it? It's like here. Uh, I just took off like the top layer of polyurethane and I'm going to restain them um, to save money. I, me, both me and my husband really like like original hardwood floors. There's nothing really wrong with them. We don't mind character. Uh, I just wanted them to be a different color. So this is the first room out of our house that we're doing. And so far it's been working out really good. So thanks for joining. Okay, so the original color that I bought for the stain was Iron Earth, um, but the color online was a lot warmer. And when I used this, it was just like straight, like dark gray and I didn't like it. So then I was like, okay, I wanna warm it up. So I got dark oak, which looked warmer online. <laughs> But it was like, when I tried it, it was way too warm and I didn't like it and I didn't like it mixed with the gray. So, went back to the drawing board and I, so my mom's floor that she got done recently, they just used like a medium gray and then all of these like pinks and purples and oranges kind of like showed through from original floor and I, it looks so good. So, and like some of the like sample pictures that I found online of like colors that I like, um, had more of like purple undertones or pink undertones. And so I got, where are they? Okay. So I got mauve to um, mix with the gray. I'm gonna mix mauve with the gray and I'm also gonna mix some eggplant with the gray and I'm going to test it and see if I can find a color that I like better. So yeah, let's see how it turns out. So I got a free table, probably from our studio, possibly if it doesn't work in there, I will put it in the workshop downstairs. So excited. So this is the free table that I got off of Facebook and I'm going to put it in my art studio, but first I'm going to paint it.
never sanded a large piece of furniture before. It takes so much out of you. <laughs> I'm not even half done. Look how pretty this wood is. Underneath. Really hope I can get the smell out. So pretty. Thank you so much for watching. Projects like this take a lot longer than a lot of people realize. If you're a DIY, DIYer, you know. Um, I've been working on this art studio project from bottom to top for the last six months and I'm just so happy that I was able to share with you guys. Thank you for being here and don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. See you next time.